What's going on, TikTok? So, my church just recently got communion the other. They look like this. Now, there are two of them on the weekend, and one for daily mass and for adoration during the season of that. Now, I posted in a lot of Catholic groups that I'm in on Facebook that picture that I just showed. I was bragging about it because I was really happy. For the first time, not the first time, I have knelt on the ground and received, but I don't really like getting down on the ground. I'm a paratrooper, I've got bad knees, and the kneelers help out a lot. I've noticed that in the comments, of course you're going to have the usual rad trad nonsense. I've also noticed that people were saying, why? Why have these? Get rid of them. What the heck? Does our Lord not deserve to be knelt before? Folks, we have got to stop shaming people for their preferences. If you prefer the traditional Latin mass, great, go to it. Don't tell people that the Novus Ordo is evil. Don't go against the Pope. Don't go against the magisterium. You're going against the church when you do that. You're not being a traditionalist. You're being a Protestant. If you enjoy a reverent Novus Ordo, which is what I go to, do that. But if you do that, don't shame the people that go to more contemporary Novus Ordo services. And again, if you go to a contemporary Novus Ordo service, don't shame people that go to more reverent Novus Ordo services or to the traditional Latin Mass. Stop shaming people for their preferences. You have your preferences, I have mine. As long as we're all doing what the church allows, praise God.